showed you guys me getting my new iPhone 8. Guys, so we have the phone. Ah, I have a new phone. Oh my gosh, I've had the same iPhone 6s for a really long time. And I'm going to show you guys what's on my new iPhone 8. I love this phone so far. It's been really fast and the camera quality is amazing. And I love the size of it and everything about it is just super awesome. I also love the color. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. By the time you guys are seeing this, I'm going to be at VidCon and VidCon vlogs will be coming up super soon. I think the first one posted yesterday for you guys. Make sure that you check that out. And let's just get straight on with the video. So first things first, this is the color of my phone. It's like a rose gold and it's super pretty, but it's like light because the iPhone 8 is glass. And I love it. I think it's gorgeous. And this is my case. I got it for like $5 at Forever 21. It was literally so cheap. And then I got the pop socket, I think from a fan in my PO box or something. But it's super pretty and I like how the nose matches the pop socket pink. You open my phone and this is my wallpaper. It's currently 322. How exciting. It's a picture of me and my best friend Hope and I just love it. I think it's really fun. So let's open up my phone. And this is my home page. I don't like to have more than one like page of apps. I don't know. I feel like it makes me feel more organized. But down here on the low bar, I have Instagram. You guys should totally follow me on here. This is just my Instagram. I recently got 152,000 followers. So thank you guys so much for that. Ooh. just got like text messages, FaceTime call. Let's see who the last person texted was. It's probably just about to say. It was probably my mom. Those are just my most important apps down there. Next we have the VidCon app. This is one of those apps that I'm going to delete once the event is over because this is only for 2018. You can basically go and see what's on and make your own schedule. If you guys went to VidCon, tell me if you got this app or not. Next we have my ukulele tuner app. This app is super cool. So this is the best ukulele tuner that I've ever used. And I recently have to re-download it. So like I literally just got it today because this is a new phone. But you basically just do like a note on your ukulele string like ah, uh, and it'll tell you what note it is this is how I like to tune my ukulele there's a new option like they upgraded it I hate when people upgrade things because it's just it changes everything and there's like you can do other stuff Ooh, beginner songs oh wait that's actually kind of cool I did not know they did that but I just use it for the tuner next is the YouTube app this is my YouTube and I just got all my subscriptions on here blah 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 you guys know the normal YouTube I love having the YouTube app I never actually I didn't know the YouTube app was a thing for like a million years and then I didn't know that there's a subscription box for like ever which is crazy like a subscription box then I got my Netflix. I'm going to be using this in the car right to VidCon, of course. And then this is my favorite folder, so it's photography. We've got PicMonkey, photos, and camera. I used to use Visco, but now that I bought like the extra expansion pack for PicMonkey, I haven't really needed to use any other editing app because I love it so much. So these are all my photos. I don't really, I haven't taken any photos really on my new phone. So I just screenshotted a bunch of photos from my original Instagram and my mom's Instagram and things like that just so I had some photos on my camera roll, but there's not super a lot. Oh, I forgot to mention my wallpaper for the back of my phone is just these cute watermelons. Let me show you these watermelons. And I think it's really pretty. PicMonkey is a really easy editing app. There's lots of features, like literally so many features you can do that I really like. This picture is already edited on here. So if I edited it anymore, it would be like kind of crazy. I've always used PicMonkey and I use it online for my thumbnails. Next we have the funness folder. So these are just some games. I have Poshmark. Poshmark is like a kid's social media, kind of like a kid's Instagram and it's really fun. And then I have this game. This game is so much fun. This game is called Fight List. Okay, popular perfume brands. What? Okay, okay, so you have to type down all of the all of the popular perfume brands. <gasps> I said Claire's, but Claren's works. Um, Tiffany & Co, I don't know. Uh, whoa, okay, um, Chanel, what's the? Um, um. Ah! That was a demonic noise. Oh my gosh. But that's a really fun game. You can basically play with your friends online and there's like a whole list of things in a category and you have to like type down what you, how many things that you know in that category. Okay, as well in the funnest app, I have Poshmark. This is basically an online selling store 
stores app. So you go to my closet and these are all of my things. You can sell clothes for super cheap. I made a whole vlog about this on Wednesday so you can check it out. It's basically like an eBay but it's for your phone and it's super simple to use. Like literally so simple. So check out my Poshmark. It's Amy Rose Cole just like my Instagram. And go check out my stuff. The last game in my funness folder is Unblock Me. This game is so much fun. I remember playing this like years ago but I recently got it again. It's so much fun. Okay, let's do it. Oh wow, that was so simple. It's super self-explanatory. You basically just try to get the the red piece of wood out of the thing. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh. But like, it's so simple, but eventually it'll get harder. Okay. Why did I just do that? Um, um, um. Okay. Uh, hmm. Wait, I don't know this one. This is hard. Wait. Ooh. Ah, this is so hard. Got it! Yeah! Next, I have White Noise, and it's right next to the Funness app. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. So I listen to this every night. I listen to rainstorm. It's literally raining outside right now, but I love these sounds. And then there's lots of different sounds you can go to sleep to. It's like ASMR, but like not. There's lots of different ones. This one is scary. Scary, I tell you. Like, you can fall asleep to that, and it's so satisfying. I love white noise, honestly. It helps me sleep so much better. The next thing is my Twitter account. My Twitter is just Annie Rose Cole, as well as my Instagram, but I think it's like Annie Rose underscore Cole. I don't know. Let's just say, hey, filming a video. Say hi. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. But yeah, this is my Twitter. Totally go follow me, you guys, because Twitter is also really, really fun. And then above Twitter, I just have like Safari, settings, the app store, notes. Ooh, notes. Let's see what's in there. <gasps> Blur it out. It's a collab. I like to write down all my notes, like collab lists and like all of that. And I like to keep very organized on my notes. The weather. Ooh, let's see the weather right now. Ooh, it's raining. Oh, what a surprise. I can literally see the rain right here. That's fun. As you guys can tell, I'm not the biggest app person. Like I don't have lots and lots of apps. And the games that I do have, I play for like, I play every single day and then I delete them and then get a new game. I, I, I like get obsessed with one game for like, a month. Comment down below your favorite game on your phone right now because that might give me a chance to download a new app. And I'll see you guys in next week's video. Bye!